Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, people that like Isaac, and my randomly changing intros. Um, how are y'all doing? Back some more Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lambs, and you guys are here because you want to watch me die again as Isaac. Which is, yeah, what's gonna happen. <laughs> well, let's, let's be honest here, I'm, I'm bad. You know I'm bad at this game. I know I'm bad at this game. So I'm actually gonna Look us in, start right for that, so I'll pop it, get a pill, swap it over to D6, re-roll it. Poison touch? I think that's poison touch. Yeah, that's poison touch. I'm not, not gonna get that quite yet. Oh, that's actually that's a puzzle pill. And you okay. Sorry if I sound a little, little weird this morning, but. So, what we're going to try to do real fast is hopefully build up our D6 kind of charge. Because, as nice as Poison Touch is, I'd rather not get hit, not rather, rather not get melee by a thing, so I want to actually use it. I don't believe that's Droid Rage. Droid Rage is something I really, really want. But I think Word Rage is blue? Oh, blue block right there, so I can get on it. Nice marks the spot, Brock. So that's actually what the official name is. Might go into that room a little later. Right now, let's grab all this money. Um, boss room and shop. And it's a combat room, so... Nice easy combat room for me to get a free reroll on. Or I can actually go fight the boss. Let's actually just go fight the boss. See what we can choose between the lesser of two heroes that we want to reroll. So if, 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 like, he gives me something like, I don't know, like, poof, make poof, poof. And I'll be like, no, Gemini, why, why are you giving me such a bad item? Gemini, Gemini, what are you doing? Gemini, stop. Gemini, stop. Go away, evil baby. Oh, well, you baby. Boop. Boop. Bye, you baby. Ah, I glitched him. <laughs> oh, almost. Isn't like just per just perfectly enough that the knockback for my tears was. Oh well. Oh well. Actually, get the spider from bosses. No, I will take boss coin first. That's telepills. Let's hope these pills do. Balls of steel. Yeah, two balls of steel pills. Range down. Not good. Anyway, so we got four spirit hearts out of that. Um, telepills to use later, and let's go reroll poison touch. So we can hopefully get something even better. -er. Poison touch. What are you now? Dead bird, okay. That's essentially the same thing. Sort of. So I should blow up this blue rock real fast, hope we we'll get some more spirit hearts out of it. And another bomb, yay! Actually, I'll blow mm. I think the secret room's right there. Eh, fuck it, looks. Maybe we'll get lucky. Yes, we are. It's my response to that. What we're actually going to do is when we get to the next floor, we're going to use telepills. Not right off the bat. Actually, right off the bat. I was going to hope we were going to put an extra second item or something, but alas. I, sh I, shall, I shall, as some people say it, deal with it. Guys, like, oh, I was just trying to brag about how I haven't we gotten hit yet on the first floor, on the first two floors. Oh, that feel, feels bad, man. Feels bad. Dead, go, dead bird. Oh, bomb. And a key. This is a good room. That was a good room. I can try to save this high priestess card for at least a little bit. 
By at least a little bit, I mean. Probably until I fight a boss that I really don't want to fight. These bosses may or may not include Peep. Well, I guess maybe not, maybe not so much Peep, but... Peep, Peep's okay. Float is not. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open the key. What do we have here? Book of Belial. Nope. Four pa Hey, look, guys, I'm... Look, guys, I can be Eve. <laughs> What's in here? I think this is a secret room. No. Hmm. Huh? That's the boss room. I don't know what the secret room is. I'm not gonna hunt for it either because I don't really want to. And we don't have to recharge our thing anyway. So it looks like we, we, we will go with Horror Babylon. Which actually does give me an interesting idea of something we can do. If we find the correct item. One which I'm not actually banking on. So Larry Jr. I'm not gonna waste my high priestess on because I don't. I do not fear Larry Jr. that much. As, as sc scary as Larry Jr. is to when you're first starting out your game, he's really not all that. He's really not that bad. Technically, you can farm his poop for as long as you want. Go away, Larry. Larry. Oh dear. I'm a hor horrible decision. What are you gonna drop with? Oh, come on. Looks like we have to deal with both of these admins we drop them. Range upgrade! <laughs> That's Krampus, I guess. We don't really have any chance. Unless it's a Krampus. Technology for. <laughs> I will. I could actually probably totally do both. Uh -huh, I want to do both of those, but I also wish I could re-roll. If I could re-roll both those items and get something even more amazing for a spirit, for a single spirit heart, or for a single heart, I guess I should say, that would be beautiful. Let's grab technology. So that range upgrade is now useless for us. We can go get Horror Babylon real fast. Oh god damn it, I'm an idiot. I could I know what I can do. Ha ha Let's do it. All in the name of rerolls. So that range upgrade is now absolutely useful to us. And a nice this is a nice easy for. Technology is a great way great way great 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 way to start us off. Um, now I need something like Spectral Tears would be an awesome... Okay, so let's actually... Let's go reroll that range up real fast. Actually, let's grab our Horror Babylon. Oh, but darn, if we could... I really want to trade away all our hearts for spirit hearts. Yes, the Horror Babylon, that would be pretty awesome. We'd have so much damage. So much damage, so much speed. Actually, we could probably go do that, uh... Curse Room? Curse Room. The wooden spoon. It's better than a range upgrade. Mm. Okay. Let's go down. Curse of darkness. Wonderful. <laughs> I got hurt from the very, very, very first room. Very, very first level of the game. That's wonderful. Please let this key, please let this room drop a key. So what I would really like right now is something like Spirit of the Night, because then I can fly and then my laser can go through things. Everything, in fact. Everything. And some more bombs. I wish I could make this deep. Maybe if I get something like polythemes, it makes the beam a lot larger. I've got a key, got a key, got a key. More bombs. So I'm gonna play, guess where the secret room is. I love I love that game. And I think I actually do know where it is. I think 
Eeny, meeny, miny... Well. Nope. Like, I'm trying to map out, map out the stuff in my head. So, that would be two down. Oh, derp. Is that way down? Yes, it does. Secret room's right here. I hope. Aha! As it is, I, I can map them. You, let's see, yeah, that's all you have to do for these kind of floors is you map out, so you map out the floor inside in your head and you can most, more often than not figure out where to go. Now, I'll bomb for that chest. Let's get the key. More bombs, no keys. Such is the way of life. I really... Yeah, this sucks. Who's our boss going to be this time? Hopefully someone that... Alright, let's, let's see if we can get a trinket real fast. Bring in the photo. Yes, I, I know that. I know that. And I'd love to show it as soon as we kill Isaac. Ace of spades. I will take that. I like. I love playing cards. I don't actually know if it's just playing cards or it's all cards. Dirty! Just who I didn't want to see. Gertie is by no means difficult, but he is annoying. He is really, really easy when you have technology up to me. I say easy, and then I get hit immediately. That's the way things work. And also, the pump I don't do the damage. Yeah. I, I could use the, mo the High Priestess card, but... But it, there's really no... I could use it just because I want to kill Gertie faster, but there's, there's really no point to it. Yep. There's, there's, there's really, really no point to it at all. Alright, so things we'd be looking for right now. Polyphemus. It has some sort of weird combination with technology, in which it does fuck tons of damage. Oh, that's my own fault. This is not really glitched now that I think about it. I'm totally cool with. Oh, because I can't obviously get into our item. Mean, let's see if we can reroll. Nope. Poop for more poop. I could have probably built Guppy out of that room. Which would have given me flying. But I don't really want Guppy items. Actually, I don't think I've built Guppy on this character, on this profile yet. It makes me really sad that we, that we could get the uh, item in the last war. No keys in there. I was, gonna, I was actually going to make a comment on the last episode about how um, uh, safety cap. Uh, 10 bombs, we don't really need 10 bombs at this moment in time. Monster's Tooth, we don't really want Monster's Tooth. Let's we'll see what our boss is. Wow, we. Chubb, I don't, I don't really. Not, not, Chubb, not. Chubb, Chubb's, Chubb's a pretty cool guy, he doesn't have to do anything. And I'm killing him a lot faster than what he did with Gertie, so... But he obviously has a lot less health than Gertie does. This is why Dead Bird is better than... The Cures it! Magical thing. The Lovers, which is useless to me because I don't have any hearts. Anyways... Yeah, I'm perfectly okay with the Tears up because it's just gotta laser, laser fire faster. And now it fired really, really fast. But really nice if we get like technology two, and then we can shoot lasers out of both eyes. Because that's what happens when we keep both of them together. Bad gas. 
whatever. Whatever. At least there's at least one more I notice. That wasn't too bad. More lovers cards. Well, I've had a blood donation machine in this floor, I'll be set. I'm actually doing quite a bit better than I normally do on, on these runs. I'm just getting a lot more lucky with spirit arts. One or the other. A penny. Now what we need to really do is um Oh god damn it, I shouldn't have gotten in here. What I'm gonna do is kill this one. So this one get the item drops. I'm probably just gonna be killing all of them. Nickel. Anyway, so we're gonna go back and re roll whatever that item is. Hope we have at least two more rooms in this. Maybe we got two more rooms. Hopefully, three more rooms with this floor with which to re roll. Um, yeah. Let's re roll that. Monster's Tooth. The Razor also is not something I want. Since the Razor will do damage plus in exchange for increased damage in the current room. Which. It's like the Book of Belial, but shit here. <laughs> Suffice to say. And after this, we're on the depths, and I. Oh, we actually will be able to reload again, hopefully. Although I may not live. I don't think I'm actually gonna live past very, very much of this. Sure, what do you have for me? So I don't actually have any, have any... My laser's nice, but I don't do any damage to go along with it. Which makes... So yeah, it shoots really fast, but it doesn't do any damage. Which is... Well... Yeah, that's why I would like polyphemus or something. So I should reduce the firing speed, but... It'll also give me... Tons of damage. It's actually the last group of enemies, I think. Yes, it is. We've got a penny out of it. And I believe, hope that last room is a combat room down at the bottom left. We will be able to reroll again. Yes, it is. I think that I'm right now is flying spectral tears with the laser through your walls. And I'm not gonna be like some people that I've seen that will turn down. Oh yeah, a blood donation machine! I know we can do with this. I will be back. I'm gonna grab me some cards. We're gonna do something oh so fun. I also found a mini completely usable donation machine. I hope that it will drop us something useful. Boop. So I'm gonna grab that little lover's card that dropped out of the boss fight. And bring it back here and we'll pop those hearts, and then we'll have eight free uses out of the blood donation machine. And we'll hopefully get a whole bunch of money so we can spend it on that shop to get the key or the or the shell game, the keys. What's this? What is this? That's it. I couldn't remember. I was disappointed when I did when I didn't remember. Actually, you know what else we can go do is instead of do it doing this, let's see if we can find the secret room last. What's in the secret room? More money. I was like, maybe it's a shitty secret room item. We can try to reroll it into something even more awesome. Even more awesome. Oop. I'm just getting like all the really bad items off of this. And oop, come on. I'm I'm good at doors. Oh dear. So we're gonna go pop this lover's card inside um inside the arcade. And attempt to get some more dear god, it looks like I've got some like weird ass hair coming out of the look this way. Um 
So, more lover's card. Oop. So, one. Two. Hearts. One. Two. Hearts. One. Two. Hearts. Okay, so we didn't get anything off that, but we can. So now we're gonna play... Uh, play these a little bit. That's the only key out of that, so now we, now we can definitely go to the shop on this floor. Make sure I won't blow up the machine, but I don't really want to try to see if I can blow up that blood donation machine. Because the average uses for the blood donation machine to pay out is eight uses. And guess what? How many we've used? That's telephones. I know that. Yes. So we will do this at least a little bit more. More bombs is always good. That's not useful. Blood donation machine. More keys. Maybe if we're lucky, this thing will pay off like a dollar or something. I'm not even really looking anymore. I'm not. Yep, it's the dollar. <laughs> the dollar. And it's control. So, that's useless to us. We can we never go to the shop without like any. Actually, we can go use this time. Oh, just money that we can't even use. Let's go to the shop. It's probably greed. Haha! <laughs> Look, look at this, look at this, look at me calling this shit. Well, hopefully he'll drop the steam sail or something that we can use to get better stuff. Die, green. D die. Two more uses for the blood donation machine. You see a heart, I see two uses for, for, I see two uses. So, one. Two. And fuck you, blood donation machine. Fuck you. So now we have essentially infinite monies. And I say essentially in like the loosest sense of the word. Because knowing me, I will find some way to go through all of this. Actually, let's use the telephones real fast. I'm just Maybe we'll find the eye mirror room. Nope. Just teleport it all the way back here. To the item room gets nothing but but shitty but shitty held items. Anyway, so let's go off to the magical land of wonder and next floor them. Down we go. Boop. And here we are in the depths. Uno. Yeah, these are uh, pretty easy to deal with now. I mean, the, the laser makes them a million times easier, no matter what. Ooh, 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 I know what I'm doing. Free health upgrade, free health upgrade, or range upgrade, or tears upgrade, or... Just keep giving him money, he'll give me stuff. It's not like I don't have any... You little dick. Give me something. Give me something good. Give me something good. Keys are good. Keys are good. Woohoo! I'm gonna save that for. Because essentially, we have. I'll reroll whatever items we get on this floor. And I will most definitely pick up that blue candle. Whenever whenever we can. This is looking strangely familiar to uh, another room that we've. Uh, another room that we've. Now, well, let's go. F no, I don't want to use this yet. Because of its the bloat, I want to have my high priest my high priest is hard and there's that there's the shop which is which will be useful and I'm going to die in this room anyway so it's not going to be important
hate these things. I hate leapers. I hate leapers. I hate leapers. I hate leapers. Ah! Flat penny. The miter. I'm going to actually take the miter. I do feel blessed. Is this gives us a chance, chance for spirit heart drops. The compass. Yes. The compass. The compass. The compass. Which will be oh so useful. That's a range down pill. I forgot about it. My spirit heart. Now, now where's the oh dear god the moss is all the way over there. Oh, this is now this is now a choice down to laziness. I guess let's grab our blue candle. And up up and away! Oh war. Not even I couldn't even re-roll if I wanted to. I have to remember to actually start using the blue candle again. No, I think I think I knocked him off. No. No. God. Damn it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it appears that this will in fact be a must. No. Can I bomb my way out? Is there? I'm just not on that wall. Is there one on this wall? No. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the lining of Isaac has in fact glitched, and I can't get out of this room. God damn it! This was this run was going so well. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Anyway. So I think that'll be it for this episode. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go cry in a hole now. So thank you everyone for watching. If you guys enjoyed the glitching of Isaac, um, you know, please leave a like or a comment below. If you guys want to see more of this, you know, please subscribe to the top left of the video or in the description section below. Thank you everyone for watching. I'll see you all next time, hopefully with less glitch. Actually, wait, I wonder. Yeah, with less glitches. Right, thank you everyone for watching. I'll see you all next time.